Hiya, are you okay? The sandstorm last night was terrifying. I didn't sleep a wink. How are you holding up? Really? Wow, you must be super brave. Hopefully I'll handle it better next time. Anyway, I was walking around town earlier, looking at the damage, and ran into Matilda. She wants us to go check out that stage outside of the Blue Moon right now, so I came to get you. Come on, she's waiting. My beautiful stage. Now, now, at least no one was hurt. We can always rebuild. Say, speak of the devil, if it isn't our resident builders here to save the day. We are in a real jam here. We wanted to do a stage performance for Mason's going away ceremony, but now the plan's in shambles. Would you two be dears and find a way to fix this thing up? I don't doubt you'll be up to your eyeballs and other commissions, but whenever the stage is fixed, we can reschedule that ceremony. So I'm afraid I must insist on an official town request of the highest priority. Heidi, dear, can you draw up a new design? I was sort of expecting the stage to collapse one of these days. So I already designed a new one. Here's the diagram, builders. Oh my, that's great. Why don't you builders decide on which part you want to do? You pick first. I'm fine with either. All right, I'll take care of the other one then. Let's see. What have we got here? Ah, I don't have the machines I'll need. I'd better get to Cheese Research Center on the double and get myself a grinder and a processor. All right, you two. Let me know how it goes. Good luck, and thanks again. By the way, if you guys need it, you can go ahead and salvage this here stage. Stagey would have wanted it that way. Every time I run into a hitch while working on construction here in Sandrock, I make a note of it in my notebook, so others won't run into the same problem. I'm currently on page 600. Why don't 
you kick back with a glass of fresh yak mill milk and hear a tall tale. Come on down to the Blue Moon Saloon, home to the tastiest treats this side of the Ufaula. A lot of people are saying Sandrock is going downhill, but for migrants like me, the cost of living makes it a pretty attractive place.
Ready to do some diving? The show must go on, but it sure isn't going anywhere until the two of us get what we need to build that stage. Say, if you don't mind me asking, how deep have you dived into the abandoned ruins? Oh, really? Wow! I always follow my scanner's readings. And I'm still only in the shallow areas. You must be really good at exploring. Well, all I know for now is that we're going to have to go pretty deep for this commission. Hope you brought some snacks. <laughs> Maybe see you inside? Later! Hey, how's it going? Getting used to the desert heat? I've been trying to think of ways to fit in and make new friends around here, and I came up with a plan. It involves you too. So, I've noticed that there's plenty of stuff around town that needs fixing. I guess people gave up on commissioning those things for some reason? Anyway, we could prepare some materials, then roll through town and fix everything we see. Seek and repair. What do you say? Nice. The San Rockians? San Rockers? Whatever, they're going to appreciate this a lot. Here's a list of materials you can get together. When you're finished, come back to me and we can start our builder cruise. that the breach here in town used to be one of the tallest buildings in the old world metropolis. It's still much shorter than the elevator in Tall Sky. Have you tried the sand rolls locals make during the Day of Memories? I won't be friends with anyone who doesn't like them.
So if you'll just move a few decimeters to your left, I think you'll find the pathway to the commission board to have become quite clear, allowing a way for me to snag a commission. Ha! No deal. You can't fool me with your mind games, Mian. Okay, I give up. Look at yourself. How long has it been since you finished that big elevator thing? And you're already back in here! At it again! You need to admit that you have a problem, Mian. You're a workaholic! I wouldn't go that far. I mean, I didn't have anything going on today. What else would I do if I didn't pick up a commission? A whole heck of a lot else! I'ma tell ya! Oh, shucks, another one of you. All right, that's it. This is an intervention. I'm taking the two of you out to do something fun. No commissions allowed. Um, I guess. It wouldn't kill me to take one day off. And I am pretty tired. Hey there, I guess we're going somewhere. Want to join us? Of Course you're joining us. As I was saying, what you two need is to relax. And what better way to relax than a rigorous and debilitating day of mountain climbing and yakmel wrangling? Uh, hey, Elle. That does sound really relaxing, but I... stubbed my toe this morning. Better stay out the mountains for today. <laughs> so, why don't we just stop into the Golden Goose Gaming Center for a little bit instead? Huh? G games Oh, but that's kid stuff. Cool, mature adult tap folk like us spend our leisure time running free on the wild frontier and... Oh, fine. I guess if y'all really want to, we can go to the game center. But I'm not playing any y'all's kid games, all right? I'm just there to keep you company, and make sure you don't relapse. Woohoo! Now let's hurry on over. We'll see you there. Yeehaw!
Have you seen our cat captain? He's a tough little guy, but he gets too friendly sometimes. Don't feed him random things. He might get sick.
Hmm. Just in case it wasn't clear, we at the Civil Corps are here to help. If you have been in any kind of trouble, you just holler and we'll come a running. That's the Civil Corps official promise. was telling me that there used to be a lot of people in Sandrock. I can't really imagine it. Be seeing you. Every time I run into a hitch while working on construction here in Sandrock, I make a note of it in my notebook, so others won't run into the same problem. I'm currently on page 600. See ya! that there's a man here named Justice. I just don't like it when my motto is associated with someone else. Alas, I'm forbidden from dueling that man for the rights to the word. <laughs> Too bad.
take note of who's doing what around here. The church appreciates outstanding citizenry as much as anyone else. By the stairs is having another dire emergency. You're not wrong. Your timing is always so wonderfully opportune. Miguel's furniture has just came in. Miguel, what's he do again? Scowling all the time. Ah! Oh, must be finance. Anyway, he's quite picky with his purchases. Fortunately, I have my ways of providing. Otherwise, he'd be totally out of luck. As always, delivery within 24 hours. Let's maintain our perfect record. You're from High Wind, right? My sis and I passed through there on our way here from Bonnerock. It's a beautiful place. Let me check and see if there are any damages. Great, no problems. Where do I sign? No need for a signature. Such carefree service. Do you offer any service to help me carry it? No? Fine, forget I said anything. Miguel was satisfied with his purchase. Ha <laughs> ha! Another perfect rating for Buy the Stars.
Um, if you don't have business with me, I'll be going. I'm crazy for trying to turn this place into an entertainment hotspot, but just look around. It's free real estate. You know what I mean? Goodbye. Hmm? X is not here.
just about to go in. Ready to get your game on? Well, here we are. Same old game center. Yawn, y'all can pick a game to play. I'll watch. I think I've seen folks on these games before. On some, two people can play at the same time. I guess the point is to see who the better gamer is. Ooh, I'm falling asleep listening to myself explain this. Guess it runs in the family. Don't mind her. How about whack-a-mole? Let's try that one first. by myself, but it's even more fun with two people. Eh? Where'd Elsie go? Could she have gone inside? Let's check. Hey, there you are. Yeehaw! Get wrecked, yo scrub! What the? I lost? Let's go again, you dumb machine! Elle, I thought you didn't want to play. Huh? What? Mion? Bug off! Y'all are bad luck! Oh, dang! I'm out of goals. Mion, how come you never told me how great games are? My heart's pounding! My mind is racing! I've never felt so alive! I... Hmm. Dang, all this pro gaming has worked me up an appetite. Onward, posse! Let's head on over to the Blue Moon to rustle up some grub! Yeah, come on, let's go!
This one's on me, cowpokes. Go ahead, help yourself. But don't just go and order all the most expensive stuff on the menu. I only work part-time for my parents. Y'all, hold tight. While you're ordering, I'm gonna go grab a surprise. Don't worry about me, I'll be right back. A surprise, huh? I wonder what on earth she could be planning. Oh well, let's eat. never know what to eat. There's so many choices. Uh, why don't you decide? Treating me, I really appreciate it. Ta da! I hope y'all left room in your stomachs for some surprise. Don't be shy, go ahead and open it up. <laughs> Gosh, Elsie, you really had a gift all ready for us? You shouldn't have. Will you do the honors? seen the look on y'all's faces. <laughs> you were all like, ah. Elsie! What? I told you I was gonna surprise you. Was I fibbing? I dare y'all to come up with a more interesting gift to give me. I'll be waiting for ya. Well, until then, I bid y'all adieu. That was fun. Until we meet again. See ya! What did you think of Elsie's surprise? Did it frighten you? So it's not just me. Elsie's always pulling these pranks on me. Sometimes I'm afraid to even leave my workshop. Well, it was nice to get out today anyway. If you get time, you should take your other friends out too. Maybe warm them up with a few gifts if they don't accept your invitation at first? I think you'll find most people to be more relaxing around. Elsie can be a bit... lively. Well, I better get back to the workshop. Catch you later. It was fun today. Good day to you, Builder. I was just looking for you. I came by to ask you to fill out a survey. It's something the church gives to all newcomers. Very standard procedure. Care to take a moment to fill it out? Wonderful! First question. How often do you follow the rules?
Mm hmm, I see. What are your opinions on bandits? Mm-hmm, I see. And finally, what are your feelings towards water wasting? All right then, let me just run the numbers here and... Uh... Hmm, well, the bad news is you're not quite ideal Sandrock citizen material, but the good news is you have lots of room for improvement, and you can start improving right this very minute. So, the short of it is, there's some sand on the plants and flowers in our temple garden. If you could go clean that up for us, that'd be great. Well, thanks in advance. May the light follow you always. Oh, by the way, You'll need a feather duster to clean up the plants. You do have a feather duster, don't you? They're all the rage these days. I just know you're going to do a great job cleaning up the garden. Don't mind me. I just got a dressing down from Pastor Miguel. I know I mess up sometimes. I'm trying my best. Hey, how's it going? Staying busy? Say, you know, I've heard the tales. Being a builder is no picnic. If you're ever having trouble, don't be afraid to ask for help, you hear? How's your wallet doing since you got here, if you don't mind me asking? <laughs> hey, I hear you. Here, take my tip jar for the day. Just a little something to get you back on your feet. No strings attached. Are you sure? Well, offer's on the table. Howdy! Oh boy. Hmm. Ah, oh, jeez. Hmm.
Oh, uh, hey, sorry about the whole spontaneous loan thing. I didn't mean to impose. Just wanted to help. That's that's all. Why didn't you say so in the first place? Sure, here you go. It's not easy being a stranger in a strange land, but we got a saying here in Sandrock. A stranger's just a friend you haven't met. Everybody's got each other's back here, and you're one of us now, so that means you too. Pay me back uh, whenever, or don't. It's all great. Just make sure you have enough to be comfortable and eat right, you know? Stop by the saloon anytime if you ever need some help, all right? People think I'm crazy for trying to turn this place into an entertainment hotspot, but just look around. It's free real estate. You know what I mean? See ya. There was more excitement around here. Why can't we be on the edge of the peripheries or something? Thank you. 